Alright guys, so today I have the spawn points of basically every token while you're playing the Imperials for Walker Salt on Jakku, which is a relatively new map you can play Walker Salt on. Um, so I figured I'd run through it, try and find all the spawn points. Um, I was lucky enough to play one game and find every spawn point for the AT-ST, for the at AT, and for um, tie interceptors, which are the three vehicles you can play in this game. The first one I find really quickly, it's going to be up by an AT-80 -AT shell. It's the ATST token. You'll see it right here. This guy grabs it. So it's that AT-80 shell um, with that like I-beam or like bar lying on it to kind of like tell it apart from all the other shells. Um, I'll stick around here for a second. I end up sticking around here for a second so you get a better idea where it is. Right here, I kind of jump out for a second because I don't feel like being blown to smithereens by an orbital strike. Um, but yeah, we'll head back up to it. So this at, -AT shell right there with that crossbeam on it, that's where, at the very beginning, the first ATST token spawns. And then we're going to jump forward because I find the at, -AT token. It's behind that wall of junk. You can see it right there as I'm running towards it. Someone else gets it, unfortunately. But um, yeah, behind this semicircle of junk, on the far left of the map, it spawns right there. I think we're going to jump forward in a second too. So, you can't really see it, but off to the side, off to the right of the screen, is the TIE Intercept token. So, you, we get a better look at it in another clip coming up. So, I think in this clip I find the next spot for the ATST token. Really close up to the big down spaceship, behind this wall of junk, ATST token. Um, I think you actually see me pilot this because I'm actually able to find the TIE Interceptor token spot. I walk right past it. I'm going to shoot it. It comes up in a little bit so you can get a better idea where it is. It's actually right next to that downed AT, AT right there behind that piece of junk right there. I turn and shoot it in a second. So, so there, that's where the TIE Interceptor token. I think there's one more TIE Interceptor token um, on this map. I didn't find it in this one. Maybe I'll do an update if I do find it. I don't know what I'm shooting at there. I think I thought I saw somebody. But I don't think anybody was there. So, and then I was able to find out like a, a nice little trick to try and keep yourself alive when you're the ATST. Because the problem with the ATST is once you get in it, you know, you're highly visible and just people just fire off torpedoes at you just like that. And it's kind of hard to dodge them because you need a giant piece of junk to block you and there's really not that many. But there's this side of the ship. So you can actually see most of the map here and keep yourself relatively well protected if you get locked onto as long as you're quick enough to run back behind the ship um, and keep yourself from getting hit by the torpedo so yeah there I was able to dodge that one um, and you can just you know basically pop in and out and try and do your part try and you know lay down cover fire fire off those rockets. I don't think I actually do the greatest job here. I only think I end up killing maybe about four people. Um, but yeah, you stay alive because that's the hard part with the ATST is as long as people are packing ion torpedoes, I mean, you go down kind of quick. Um, sometimes you get lucky and nobody has uh, decided to equip their ion torpedoes. Um, so you stay alive forever because all they've got to do is just shoot you with their guns, which takes a really long time um, to kill you with. Um, the hero does spawn on this map, so so I guess you do have to watch out for that. Because, I mean, I found out when I was playing a game earlier this week, if you are Luke, Luke can take on an ATST actually relatively easily. Um, he just gets down by their legs um, and just goes to town with his lightsaber. I was able to just hack one to pieces, uh, make a fool out of it in one of my games. I think I recorded it. I may be able to show you guys that. But yeah, I, was, I found out that this week that when you're in Luke Skywalker and you come up against an ATST, you don't really need to be that scared. Basically, get underneath their legs, um, and you're so quick that they can't really uh, get out and try and like shoot you because they can't look directly at their feet. So that you just go to town on it with your lightsaber and just just destroy it. But yeah, at this point, I couldn't really see anybody, so I was thankfully able to get that guy to commit suicide trying to take me out but the bases were moved forward so I walk forward I think I get taken out in like three seconds here by a torpedo but I felt like I really wasn't doing anything hiding behind that ship um, but yeah 
in a few seconds we'll see where the next ATST token is. And it's right here behind this downed TIE fighter. So it's nice. I mean, it's nice and protected. If you get it, you don't have to worry about being shot. Um, so and it doesn't spawn you too far away. Um, and I want to show you, I, I died there. And it, it isn't random. It does spawn in the same spot. And I can show you in this video right here. Because I, I, once I get down, I run right back to it and I wait for it. Um, I have counted the cooldown time. The cooldown time for the token to appear from the death to the respawn is 15 to 16 seconds. So if you go down, you know that you've got about 15 seconds before the token comes back. And then the final spot is right here. The final ATAT -AT token. You see my buddy gets it right there. It's right next to that giant half circle thing stuck in the ground. But the final ATAT -AT token is right there. Alright guys, like always, if you like this video, like and subscribe. We're trying to put out videos every Wednesday and Saturday. Um, I hope to see you guys back.